Oh, and imagine it's what the amazing. profile would be. Yeah. Interest, I know. decoupage, glue guns, <laughs> gardening, <laughs> art, crafting. <laughs> well, Matt was talking about this. He said he was really surprised at how candid she was about it. It's, it's really interesting. We're not surprised. She's like that. Yeah. I, hope she's she, awesome. I hope she gets a date out of this thing. We're going to try to help her meet her match. It really I mean, look out. I mean, when six foot seven dances like that, it really makes an impact. I mean, it, I'm just saying, I didn't even know who he was when I arrived that morning, and I was not going to put myself in a position. And Sydney are getting stronger each and every day, but as you know, Savannah, with their kinds of their injuries, it's going to be a long road physically and emotionally, but they have such an incredible support system. In fact, their whole family says they're not just Boston strong, they're Corcoran strong. Oh. So, Well, they are certainly family. proving that, and it's so wonderful that the gentleman came and said, I had the same injury as you, and look at that. All Gabriel Ramirez, a Marine, exactly, a wounded <laughs> veteran who came in and just lifted their spirits when they needed it most. So he personified hope for sure. Absolutely. Natalie, thank you. Hey guys, the train keeps rolling here. We have a champion now for four weeks in a row. The drum roll, please. It is mm -hmm. the dog that can't catch. Oh. Personal favorite, Driving Miss Crazy. Oh, a hilarious twist. Just <laughs> Can you imagine her in about 20 years? Oh my oh. gosh. That's your television driving. producer. <laughs> we should point out August won that argument. He turned around yeah. and drove. <laughs> That's it. So he did it. She was told. Click number three, he was here with us this week. AJ Clemente, the anchor who's out of a job after just one show. That's a promo. <laughs> <laughs> I will tune in for that. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> Say, Martha, do you like gladiator movies? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so Still ahead, your favorite soap opera is going digital, but first, this is today on NBC. Happy, happy song. I know. I was going to say, it's so great where it's Friday, the weekend's here. Oh, sorry, Lester, the weekend's here. That's okay. <laughs> you guys are my warm act up there. This is, this is kind of like before the big up. concert, you know, yeah, the, uh, a five-day run up to the weekend. <laughs> we'll see you all weekend on today and nightly. In the meantime, here's a look at how it all unfolded this week right here on Today. Look who stopped by to help us out this morning, Miss Tamron Hall. And let me in. Yeah. Yeah. Security. Wow. wow. Good morning, guys. Well, people out there are from News Nation. <laughs> no. It is. The News Nation is out in full force. News on the Nation, plaza this yes, definitely. Let's get to our take three. The silent victims, because again, we're hearing about the yeah. air travelers because you've got pilots getting on the plane saying right. that one hour yes. delay, blame the U.S. Right. government. And so, but the Head Start mom, this week. you know, yep. I saw one story on a Head Start mom, I think in Ohio, who is like, I don't know where to, what to do. Right. You know, mm -hmm. it's crazy. Not to mention seniors who need meals yep. on wheels. Sure. Yep. Let's go to take two. This is just a beautiful magazine cover. Boston Magazine. Well, this, this will fade into memory. Right. And we have to keep remembering them because this is going to be something, as you said, it's going to be going to be dealing with them. I'm about to give you a birthday. <laughs> uh -oh. Sunday marks the 10th anniversary of iTunes. Wow. It's been 10 years since iTunes I was came eight out. when they started that? The sound quality of yeah. vinyl is far beyond. Warmer. It's much warmer, much richer. You hear the bass. It just, you know, you get all of that where you don't get that. I'm still it's holding up for the comeback of the laser disc. No. <laughs> the eight tracks, no, right? The eight tracks. Exactly. You want the eight tracks? Exactly. You know the eight they tracks. had a short Let's window. Bring the eight tracks back. It was yes. like a year. That laser that disc, gone. that was like, boom. <laughs> These giant <laughs> platters. Who thought that was a good idea? <laughs> hey, let me get something the size of my head. No, twice as big. And put it in there. Wow. That's some poor I can person serve right dinner now on saying it. that was my idea. <laughs> Seemed like a good idea at, at the, the time. time. Yeah. At the time. I had, I mean, I had, it kind of it ended up being what we have now with Blu ray, right? I mean, isn't that sort of the same technology? But much smaller. Mini. Yeah. yeah. Do you know how many songs you have, iTunes, on your oh, iPhone? I don't know the number. I have thousands. the same playlist that I've had over and I over too. again. Well, and he's going like this, and then Tamron's going like this. So why would yeah. you believe that that's a real... <laughs> that's what because I'm saying. Because it's all about you. you. Exactly. Yes. Oh, we know how hard it is to lift, and we're not pandas. That oh, You'll see, and you'll we're apologize. We're not pandas, she said. Okay. <laughs> okay. Red pandas. Let's just do the weather, Al. How all about right. that? Ladies, thank you. Thank this you. This is great for the fans. The fans have spoken. I understand there's a Facebook page even with some 4 million followers they demanded this, so now it's happening. I know, I know. So, Thanks to Rich Frank and Jeff Watton. Do the soaps pick up right back where they left off? I mean, it seems like Victoria Lord, your character, has been <laughs> through it all, including yeah, not everything. nearly died what else three could happen? times. Right. So what well, else could she dead a couple of times. She's been dead a couple but of times. Totally pick up five years later. But. All right, and we'll tell you that it all starts April 29th. Ladies, thanks so much. Thanks. Next week. <laughs> up next week. That's great. <laughs> you can so catch more of Matt's actual interview with Martha next week here on Today. I just love how they do that, though. It's pretty good. They even found a voiceover guy. He sounds just like the, uh, yeah. the announcer. Yep. <laughs> Was that The Bachelor? I think they spliced The Bachelor in there. Kind of looked I like so. a little bit of that. I'm Willie Geist along with Al Roker and Natalie Morales and Lester Hold inside Studio 1A coming up this half hour. Do you ever lie to your doctor maybe just a little bit? Yeah, I sent you the bill.
<laughs> Those among others. I'll tell you why they might get you into a little trouble coming All up. All right. Also ahead in celebrity news, a sneak peek at Beyonce's newest single, plus Ben Affleck becoming a doctor. We're going to tell you what that's all about. My son, the doctor. And an amazing performance from an impressive group of singers on their way, literally, to Carnegie Hall. First of all, let's find out what's coming up on the weekend edition of today. Well, all right, Lester, thanks a lot. We'll look forward to that. Now Al's got to check of the weather. All right. And Beyonce fans eagerly anticipating her newest album, her fifth album. And there have been some leaks of uh, some of the songs, but her newest song, actually, Standing in the Sun, is featured in an H&M ad. Tell us more about that. H She's yeah. very hands-on mom. So like 15 cute. months. All right, moving on to another one of our favorites around here. Ben Affleck, now the Oscar winner, yeah. apparently is pledging to live on $1.50 a day. Yes. Now, what is this all about? As we reported earlier, she's trending today. She talked about how she lost all that baby weight after her having her second child, her daughter, back in 2011. That was great stuff. Thanks, as Thanks, always. Natalie. And have fun at the White House Correspondents' will, Dinner. She's headed up there. Coming up next, some beautiful music from a chamber choir on their way to Carnegie Hall, literally, right after this. Nated by Michael Buble. Plus, we've got more tips to drop 10 pounds by Memorial Day, this time talking about the right kind of snacks. And secret beauty tips from top experts and celebrities. But first, a check of your local news and weather, and have a great weekend, everyone. Bye.